it's working. Hey, when I say the phone been getting real hot, like it's about to explode, so I've been having to chill out with that. Good morning, fam. We got time. We got time. Good, good afternoon to you. Good evening to you. And good night to you. Cookies, wherever you at, yeah. We're going to read out loud and grandma time one more time, okay? Okay. The phone play too much, y'all. Hey, y'all know me. I'm old-fashioned, so I'm about to tell you don't even depend on it, okay? For a reason, okay? The Holy Spirit know how to keep you company when you invite him in to do that. Hey, but I pray y'all good. If not, we gonna read the good news, okay? That's that's why we here, so we can heal by reading the word first, and get that spiritual food in there, so you don't be starving yourself to death, okay? Because you need to feed your spirit, okay? Same way you feeding your flesh, over. You, if I was you, I would overfeed my spirit, okay? That means do some fasting, okay? See, y'all out here eating all this food, forgetting you need to fast and pray. Fast and pray, okay? Because, see, if y'all can see the spiritual warfare that's happening to you, you would probably have a heart attack, man. It, it, man. Cause y'all don't know your your heavenly father is infinite, okay? He's can't be touched. Okay, he can touch you but can't be touched by you, okay? Let that sit man. To the people that laugh at the Holy Bible but don't understand it's already established. I got to keep reminding you, you're going to be looking stupid, okay? Because you're not understanding it. Every last word is, is already set. Yeah. It's already fixed. It's set. It's, it's waiting for you to walk through with the Holy Spirit in you, okay? Cause you can't walk through without Jesus Christ as your Lord and Savior and the Holy Spirit. Okay, because God is not going to allow any simple thing around him. He not. He not. So, before I pray and read, let me, uh, the Holy Spirit yesterday led me to a couple of, uh, conversations that happened to be on uh, YouTube. He was like, listen to this. It, it was one of them shorts, them reels. And I'm learning one thing. Everybody went what they want, but what they want don't have nothing to do with what they need. You know what I'm saying? It's, it's what they want to do is hurt people. But what they need to understand is when you hurting people, there's the consequence for that. Hey, 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 well, there's small-minded, perverted way of thinking. I can't do it. I, can't, I, I I just came from all that, okay? I'm still fighting. You feel me? Like, man. People so much want to pimp people until it's their turn to get pimped by God. And I be sitting there looking at them like, do you not remember what you said you wanted to do to these people? How you wanted to do it and for as long as you wanted to do it in front of the eyes of God. And God sent me to warn you, don't be doing that to people unless you ready for that to be done to you. You feel me? And they were laughing. They were like, you don't know what you're talking about. I was, I was man, see. see. They've been living in that darkness for so long. Even when they see the light, it's not light to them. It, 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 it's more like a night vision spot. Like... You know, when you got night vision goggles on, you see a little spot. That That's what it is. That's what goodness and light is to people who, who are of darkness. They they still can't see the light. 
That's that's why Jesus said, you have ears to hear, yet you cannot hear. You have eyes to see, yet you cannot see. And so this this scripture always remind me of beautiful women. Okay, cause you you would expect from a man's point of view that beautiful women get anything that you want. Yeah, but it come with a cost. It come with it come with some some evil things. And I didn't know that until I started hearing them speak up. I was like, so y'all keep dealing with the men that women pick men that they like, but these men don't like them at all. And they still doing that, okay? And so, like I said, it goes back to wants and need. People want something so bad, not understanding that it's costing them their life. It's costing them their life. When they start winning, see what I'm saying? Every time I'm about to do my thing with y'all, read and pray, he always messing with my throat and, and nostrils, my nose. So. So, yeah, so, um, I didn't know beautiful women were getting treated like trash because they ain't speak on it. Not to my ears, and you and they know I'm hard at her. Yeah. Talking about, well, you just don't know. No, y'all just don't know that you keep playing with evil men thinking it's going to get better. It's not. So be wise and go to a godly man. Talking about I don't like godly. How you know, man? How you know? I I watch, I watch men. I did watch men force themselves on beautiful women, and I did see the beautiful women look on their face like you. But yet they still dealt with the man. Like 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 they were forced to do that or they chose to say in that. Which one is it? Cause I don't do confusion. And and I'm learning that when a woman try to use a man for his possessions, you are already evil and 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 preparing the path for destruction. Cause you you're not giving yourself to God for to be a help me. I noticed y'all do not want to be what God created you to be, and it's not hard. Y'all yeah? keep making it hard, rebelling against what's simple. Like, put it like this. The devil then manipulated y'all so... He then manipulated all y'all pretty beautiful women to the point where he got you right where he needs you. He know how to give you things that will keep you in his darkness. Because uh, I refuse to be watching this over and over and over. How how can the women be beautiful and evil at the same? No, man, you gotta pick one, sweetheart. You gotta pick one. You can't be beautiful and evil at the no, no, man, no. Got it here with that. Yeah. When well, the brother has daughter and they little. You always praying over them, yeah. Uh, to this day, I never stop praying over my daughters, whether they hurt or not, yeah. Because I, 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 I know evil men, right? And they okay with being evil in front of God, yeah. Because they don't believe in God, but yet they believe in all the evil they can do, and it and, and it has no consequence until the consequences slowly hit them when they least expect it. So I'm here to warn these women, pay attention. 
I'm tired of yelling and screaming, uh, uh, trying to get your attention to get back to Jesus Christ. He is your first lover, okay? He is your first lover, okay? And if you do not make him your first lover, don't be expecting these men to do better than, your, than, the, than our Lord and Savior, yeah? That is not happening, yeah? He is Lord and Savior first for a reason, yeah? So... I'm just saying, y'all, y'all, I don't do confusion, and I don't, I don't understand why women can't follow simple instructions, yet y'all want all these things that's not good for you anyway. A woman that's greedy will fuck up a whole environment, man, over her greed. I'm basically saying, make yourself clear about what you want, ladies, because brothers don't do confusion. They will walk past you like like a stop sign <laughs> and don't stop walking past. <laughs> All right, so the video I was about to explain, it basically was one man was claiming he, he's the son of God. Okay, claiming he a Christian or whatever. Or with the Hebrew Israelite. You know it's funny, these brothers claim they Hebrew Israelite, but they don't have no relationship with Jesus Christ. That is so backwards to me. Alright, but anyway, this man was talking about how uh men don't work don't want these women that they was having a conversation face to face with. They he he was he his answer to me wasn't wasn't solid. It wasn't it wasn't valid. It wasn't strong enough. Okay. What I'm learning, these, these men are cut from a different breed, bro. These men beat on women. I'm not from that breed, bro. I don't. I, <laughs> what? Man. Hey, beat your ass for beating on that woman, bro. Like, you can't treat her like a queen. Walk away, nigga, man, monster, reprobate piece of shit, whatever you want to call yourself, man. You not a man, though, if you beating on women, man. You not, yeah. And if you pimping women, treating them like property, you ain't, well, you not no man, man, you not. So the women were saying that uh, men don't feel out pain or whatever, and, and, and I could tell just by how she was coming at it. She wasn't living right either. Because the word said, submit to your man, you will have protection. Don't submit, you're not going to be protected. Yeah? And, and y'all, keep, y'all keep playing this pimp hoe game. Hoes and pimp, uh, you're going to get exactly what you playing with. you going to get exactly what you I don't know why you expecting it different. I don't, man. They got the nerve to come at me talking about I'm, I'm, uh, I'm high maintenance. Man, what? I, uh, man, ain't nothing high maintenance about me, man. My spirit, my spirit is high maintenance. Let, let get that clear. Yeah, my spirit is high maintenance. Okay. But my outside, I, I, I sweat too much. I get I get sweaty real quick when I'm moving, working, doing anything. Just move. That's why I stay away from people, okay? Because I work. And I love to work. If I can't work, I don't need to be around nobody, bro. Because I like to keep myself going, bro. Got a lot to do, okay? Why y'all, why y'all lazy, man? Talking about you and your mind gonna get a pedicure and manicure. Ain't nothing manly about that, Mr. Frank, right? Man, ain't nothing manly about these, Mr. Frank, right? And I mean that. For my heart to all heart. If your mind okay with mine going with this. So, so this go back to, uh, when I had to tell
everyone. At, at, at the time, man, at the time, I was losing the man that was raising me. And I knew they weren't telling me the whole truth. They can't. They were scared. And every day I woke up and they see me again, they were scared. But people be thinking I'm not even clear. Maybe I'm doing a good job and playing it up. Cause if, if I tell you everything I know, you're going to have a heart attack, bro. And I ain't trying to do that. I ain't got no no money for no hospital bills. Nah, I'm, and I'm not paying your hospital bills. Okay? Like, hey, I told my children that. Y'all better not. Y'all better stop fighting. We not going to no hospital. Man. And I'm not paying no hospital bills. Man. So you better treat each other accordingly. Better treat each other right. And if you get hurt, shake it off. <laughs> I'm not, man, I ain't got no money for that, and I'm not going to die trying to get it, bro. This ain't 50 cent over here. And I don't knock him for doing what he had to do. Everybody's life was already written out, yeah. I'm just here to remind you to make sure Jesus Christ is your Lord and Savior because you still walking in your life that's already written out. Yeah? That's how powerful our Heavenly Father is. Like a, like a holy Bible, he wrote our life out. Now it's up to us to include him in keeping us in right standing with the life he wrote out for us. It's up to us to do right by him. Call free will, man. Like, so, but, but you got to be smart to understand preordained and predestined. That should, that should already position you to get rid of your flesh and give God the chance to feed your spirit through the flesh, okay? That way you in alignment with whatever he blessing you with or chastising you through, okay? You got to be prepared to be chastised so you can embrace the uh, the rewards of being obedient to your heavenly father. See, see, my heavenly father know I don't want, I don't care about no rewards if I'm not doing right by him. Okay, I don't care about the benefits if I'm not doing right by him. My goal is to do right by him. That way, I know I'm not pissing him up. Okay, that way. <laughs> Because people out here really think they God. Man, over the, I, man, that is. You know how sick and twisted that is, man? And they be okay about it, laughing and giggling until it's their time to die. Oh, I'm dying. I'm, yeah, yeah, you thought she was God, man. Like, and God had to remind you that is not true. And to the people that want to be lowercase gods and goddesses instead of a child of God, you're going against your heavenly father, claiming that title as the God and God. I'm going to keep saying that to you, dumb fuck, because you keep trying to throw that in my face. I had to unsubscribe. Bro. Like, nah, man. you can't be around my energy with that bullshit title. Bro. That is not good for you. What's wrong with just being his child? Yeah? But nah, you gotta go against him and pick the lowercase g, thinking not gonna change anything. It's not, yeah. it's not. Yeah. And to all those who still keep trying to play God over me in my life, I'm, I, I, this is a warning. I'm gonna read out loud to you again. Enemies, enemies, okay. Cause those who love me, they probably hiding somewhere, calling themselves loving me. Uh, whatever, whatever. If I can boldly call you out for, for being a friend, you can do the same for me. But since you're not going to do that, I'm going to just specifically make this shiny. For all those who do subscribe, I'm, 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 I'm expecting you my enemy. Okay? I'm expecting it. I'm expecting it, bro. 
because I got a problem with being supportive, and I don't need it. Like I said, I would go back to zero subscribers just to prove to y'all I know what I'm doing over here, and I don't need your help. Because if you wanted to help, you would have did it right the first time. Cookies. So let's read out loud, y'all, in Grandma Town. These videos I've been running into, been y'all been telling on y'all stuff, man. You hating on me waking you up, but yet what would you do if I wasn't around to wake you up? That part. Cookies. Uh, stop treating each other like trash, or that's how God going to treat you. Cause, cause you, 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 you dealing with his creation, okay? It's his creation. And what you do with it, you're going to be held accountable for it, yeah? That part. Thank you. All right, so we in the book. L-U-K-E, Luke. We're in chapter 5 or 6. Right? Chapter 5. Ooh, chapter 5 or 6. Yeah. Chapter 6, I'm playing, I'm playing, chapter 6, and on page 1,285 in my Aunt Anna's Holy Bible, cookie started by my dirty fingernails, like I said, I be working, bro. I be all up in the plant, trying to grow my little plant, yeah. And get right by, try to wash my hands. I don't clean it all the way. Oh, wait. So, chapter 6, and the title on the top of the page is say, Lord, a little ID, Lord of the Sabbath. S A B B A T H. Lord of the Sabbath. Okay. <laughs> May you keep it holy. At some point, Jesus and the hundred and forty four thousand have to recognize we 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 on the same one to cook. Okay. As the spiritual body of Christ. Okay. I just had to throw that out there because God don't do confusion in his own body. Okay. But he will take a mess and clean it up because Romans chapter 8, verse 28, for all things work out for those who love him, okay? They work out for the good, for those that love God and are calling to and are called to his purpose, okay? <laughs> Your spiritual warfare. I, I think I'm the... Uh, I think I'm the reminder that y'all have to be prepared to fight the spiritual warfare and physically defend yourself. Cause they do not like your light, bro. They can't handle it. Yeah, they can't handle it, bro. They can't. <laughs> and you see, they trying to get rid of you and your light. God is not having it. So do your work. Equip yourself by spiritually feeding yourself. Okay, what we about to do now, read out loud on grandma time, all right? I, I need y'all to be prepared to be a soldier, okay? Not no little wimp, not no little, no. Being a Christian is not for the weak, y'all. It's not, you know, it's not for the weak. And to all these churches out here professing they little wimpy, man, y'all be having me laughing because that is not of Jesus Christ, man. Jesus wasn't no wimp, man. I don't know where y'all got that from. Yeah, Jesus loved all, but he did correct too. And y'all too scared to admit that part. Living in all this pride, disgusting, and leading children astray with that, man. Talking about, it's okay if I can change the child gender. No, man. <laughs> to those that's forced in evil situations and circumstances, call on Jesus. Because you only going to make the excuse, oh, I was forced to do that. Yeah, but did you call on Jesus to give you a way out of it? 
Because if you didn't have that message through the faith to call on Jesus to help you out, then, then don't be expecting peace. Because your free will is your free will, man. Just because the circumstances make it look like you've been forced to do something don't mean you still don't have your free will to call on the Almighty G, Lord and Savior. Yeah. 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 All right, sure. Hey, before, man, see. And to those who didn't agree with all these women getting murdered by these police officers, the way I'm saying it, these women didn't pick God, Jesus Christ, and the Holy Spirit. That goes back to the beginning of what I was saying. Y'all still want what you want, and it's not good for you. You need to focus on what you need. That is good for you. I'm, 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 I'm talking to the women because y'all are life givers. Men can't breathe without women, bro. Like, duh. Y'all the one that got it here. Even though the man spit the seed in you, you still had to decide if you wanted to carry it or not. You only have the baby or not. I, man, y'all catching me, okay? Man, I don't do confusion. I go smack through it. I go through it. I don't do it, okay? That goes through the confusion, okay? All right, sir. What don't you have me say, Holy Spirit, kids? It's, it's one woman that's actually on point, even though she claimed to be a goddess or whatever. The Holy Spirit said, no, don't unsubscribe. Say subscribe to it. The only reason why I'm still subscribed to her is because when me, God, Jesus, and the Holy Spirit be having that conversation, she be repeating the whole conversation we just had. And so that's when I was like, oh. Like she was in the conversation with me, God, Jesus, and the Holy Spirit the whole time. So that's why I haven't unsubscribed yet. It was like, this is crazy, man. But I'm not surprised because God works in mysterious ways, okay? He works in mysterious ways. He do. To the point where you can't deny what he is doing is it, it, for your good. So I ain't unsubscribed, but another woman I did unsubscribe because she wasn't claiming Jesus Christ. She was throwing men in here and there, but she wasn't really claiming. She was claiming to be a goddess. It, I'm, why y'all pressed to be claiming something that goes against your heavenly father? Thinking that's going to end in a very good way. It's not. And if you got children, sweetheart, be smart and, and, and change the name. Okay, what's wrong with being a daughter of God? What's wrong with being the queen? Daughter of God. It's nothing what man, you wanna be an evil ass goddess. Thinking you claiming Jesus Christ with that. Yeah, he know your heart and what he telling me is you not bullshitting him. You trying to, but you not bullshitting him. You bullshitting yourself. Why y'all keep claiming evil things, expecting good? Yeah. And, and here's the funny part. I unsubscribed from this one particular woman, and she still keep popping up, man. I was like, didn't I, didn't I unsubscribe while she still keep popping up, man? I, I don't want to hear nothing you guys say. Yeah? You don't believe in Jesus Christ, so leave me alone. Okay, can't even do that. Man, y'all gonna stop harassing me with this shit, man. Like, claim Jesus Christ and I listen. Don't, I don't wanna hear nothing you guys say. I don't care. Cause y'all be taking your outer beauty and using it for evil. That is the most sick shit you can do in my eyes and, and around me. I had a fake ass mother who did that to me. Like, I don't even think she my real mother, but okay, whatever. She took her beauty and tried, man, no, you can't be beautiful and evil, man. God is not the author of confusion, nor the creator of it, man. 
If not, then. I believe the day my wife shows up and find me, because I'm not going out looking for her, bro, and she knows that. And if she expects something different, move on. Have at it, move on. That way I can continue doing my work, perfecting my craft for the kingdom, okay? Because I, uh, y'all, man, and it's still on these dating sites when we going to meet. When you know how to follow instructions and find me, okay? Because y'all don't understand that you are bait for the hackers, the secret society. You are bait. Now, if you want to get killed, that's on you. But you're not about to use me to do that, yeah? No. It's happening on earth over here. Otherwise, stay away from me with your evil and wickedness. I don't want it, eh? I don't need it. I'm good. You was okay with me being harmless, laughing at me, doing all that. I was like, y'all not fooling nobody. Y'all not, man. And y'all had a head start, a 40 year head start to do all the damage you wanted to do to me, to try to take me out, kill me. And, and now God saying it's my turn. And now that it's my turn, I want to mind my business like I've been doing the whole time. I want to perfect my craft and do right by his country. And y'all can have at it. I'm not missing nothing. Y'all not doing nothing new under this sun, okay? Y'all not. So you need to stop trying to uh, manipulate me to pay attention to you. I'm not pressed. Yeah, I'm for rooting you on. I'm sharing you on to be the best person you can be. That's easy. That's easy. That is nothing. That's, that's my core being. Share, encourage. You're supposed to encourage one another to do the right thing. That is nothing. But let it come to spiritual warfare and you want to try to be around me to do evil to me, God going to whip your ass. See? I don't know why women think they, they can try to play me and be all good for another nigga that don't even like him. Right? See, see, I, I knew what I was doing, y'all, when I got married the first time. And, and I was talking to God. I was like, look, you, you already gave me a vision. You gave me the vision. She's going to fuck this up. Not me. I'm not going to fuck nothing. She's going to fuck this up. Watch. Watch. Just like all the women in my life know they fucked up. I mean, all they had to do was treat me like I treated them. Correctly. Like, because they were showing off for niggas that was already jealous of me, bro. So they wanted to play that dumb game with them, not me. That's what you messed up. See, like I say, growing up, niggas always competed with me in every little thing. Even me breathing, bro. They were competing in that. It was a problem, bro. It was the problem. Everywhere I went, it was the problem with another man trying to, you know, fight me just because that light must be bright, man. But it's one thing when I'm minding my business and you, you trying to find your way to me while I'm minding my business. That, that speak volumes right there. That means you that press to disrespect God and his, cre and his creation that's there to be a blessing. You press to hurt that creation that's a blessing just to find out when you heard it you can't get blessed no more but I'm telling y'all now they did not give a f that I was the blessing to them they did not give a fuck well when I still had to fight I'm still fighting these motherfuckers okay I'm not losing to none of you faggot dyke piece of shit well I will fuck you up and I mean that in Jesus' name, okay? Hey, you don't like me cussing? Hop off the channel. Because over here, we keep it raw. Straight to the point. I don't got no image to uphold. I don't care about no image. I don't. It's, it's, it's already sad enough that you got two men at the top of this pyramid. And it's, it's not a male and female at the top of this evil-ass pyramid. 
It's man, man, man. It, man, y'all better get fuck out of here, out of here. They getting destroyed, man. Just by me praying and reading out loud the word of God. Because they know it's wrong. And they better get it right, but they can't. Because they too stuck in their evil ways. Like I said, man, the fight over every little thing. Every little thing. And, and as soon as God got me away from all that, and it's still around me, but it's not as pressed on as it was before I got over here, I was like, Lord, if it wasn't for you making me laugh and keeping me company, I would be shedding blood. Yeah? That's it. Somebody trying to climb me. That means they spying on me while I'm recording, yeah. Maryland. I'm not in Maryland. And when I was dead, you were trying to get rid of me. So what you calling me for? Y'all play too much. But like I said, man, it's, it's not as press on as it was when I wasn't here, okay? Cause when I was in the DMV, hey, man, that whole, that whole side up, I, anybody can see through it. See, see, their problem was, they ain't like the way I was responding to the evil they were doing to me. That's because I knew what the fuck they were doing. Fair like, see, if I do that shit to you, the same evil you was doing to me, whoo, whoo, man. That's why God is God, okay, because right. right. this family thought they could do what they were doing, then smile in my face. I was like, yeah, yeah, that pop that drink and smoke with me. Yeah, I can do that with you, demon, because I smoke and drink. Yeah, you know why? Because if I don't, I'm going to fuck you up in that sober, in that soberness. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to share some blood. That's why I smoke and drink, yeah. Because I know the demons, I see the demons around me 24 7, yeah. And so when people keep thinking they sneak and slick, I was like, okay. Just don't get mad at how I respond, okay? This is a warning. Because they be thinking they got me wrapped around their fingers so bad, I be like, watch this, yeah. Watch this. I bet all of them looking real stupid right now, like, wish I ain't do that. Nah, you, you with your core being of who you are when I show that. See, I love. And they, they can't stand that because they don't love themselves. That ain't my fault. That ain't my fault you hate yourself. But but, but you trying to make me hate myself was, not, was never going to work, man. Never. Never, not when God Himself come to you and tell you He loves you. Nothing else matters, man. And, and I mean that nothing. When God Himself come to you and tell you He loves you, in whatever kind of form He do, nothing else matters, y'all. Yeah. That's why I be telling you. Read God's love for you before you go out here dumbfounded, okay? You, you, you need to feel God's love for you. Otherwise, you're going to keep living the darkness you live in. Because his love is really light. It's really light. It make you fly without wings. It make you fly. I mean that. Literally, whatever you want to put it. His love is really light, bro. It's, man, hey, it's not heavy. Man. The world is putting that heaviness on you because the world don't like itself. The world commits suicide to itself every day. That's why God said, don't worry about tomorrow. Or with, it, 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 worry about right now with me. He, he's begging you to spend time with him because he can lead you in your purpose, so he can get the glory out of it. That's the whole thing. He created you for his glory. Now, if you think that's 
that the way you think is better than what God has for you, I'm not even going to fight you, man. You're going to find out the hard way that your smart mindedness is, is God has something way better than your smart minded way of thinking and moving out here. He's mysterious. He's miraculous for a reason. I just spent 40 minutes trying to explain to y'all the way y'all think and move doesn't phase me. It, it doesn't. It doesn't. Y'all, y'all need to do better than that. And all these commercials talking about kingdom wealth and kingdom marriages, that's that bullshit, bro. That's that bullshit. Y'all need to cut that out, man. All you doing is lying. Leading other people that think that that's for them, too. And, it, and you think because you saying if this message resonates with you or not. It, it, no. You want, the message, you want the message to hit everyone that's listening. You don't say shit like, if the, nah, man. know your audience, man. So if y'all keep saying shit, thinking you're going to get away with that little slick shit. No, man. If this message resonates with you, fine. If it doesn't, I don't want to hear that shit because I see through the bullshit, man. Like, and then you asking people to pay you. Uh, but I, I, like I said, I know too much. And, and they know that. Now what? Come correct or hop off my channel. I, I mean that. I, I don't want no aching in the Joshua camp. We don't need no sneaky slick shit in the camp. In the camp, okay? Cause God will open the ground right where you at and close it up like it ain't nothing. Like it ain't nothing. Like it ain't nothing, man. So, yeah, call on Jesus Christ and stop using your want. Because your want is it, not more important than what you need. Feed your spirit the truth. Because you need the truth to survive out here. Not even survive, just to be heaven on earth like God created you to be a helper of the kingdom of righteousness. Y'all call it being the light working, okay? But don't think you over here fooling me and I see straight through all that. Just because I don't say nothing don't mean nothing. You, you call yourself such and such, just make sure it's pure from the heart. Because most of these people out here are desperately wicked in their heart. And God knows that. Yeah, I said what I had to say about that man claiming uh, the women he see they don't want. And the women claiming that they hurt by the men that don't want them. Um... But for y'all not meant to be around each other, point blank. But y'all keep forcing it, which you expect. What do you expect? You didn't pick God first to lead you to your partner. So you're going to get what you're going to get. See, if God is not first priority, don't be expecting peace, bro. Don't, don't be expecting peace, y'all. Done. I got a one you know out of nowhere. I was doing just fine before I pushed play on this jump. But I was, man. All right, so let's read, man. Page chapter six in the book of Luke, L U K E. <laughs> Luke lord of the sabbath lord of the sabbath god loves you he loves you enough to got me recording again in the midst of all these people calling distracting me 
Y'all play too much, bro. Y'all play too much, bro. Think you stopping me, bro. Nah. See, you thought me, you gonna die before I do. I promise y'all that. I promise y'all that. To those who don't know me and you just now coming to find out who I am, my own people who call me family, friends, whatever, they've been all trying to get together to take me out my whole life. God is not playing, baby. So if you think I'm a a, a joke, you're going to be looking like the joke, okay? Because I just told you the truth. People been trying to kill me my whole life, man. So let that sink in and why you see and why you keep seeing me pop up on my own channel now, okay? On my own channel that God blessed me to be up here on. Don't get mad at me. It's God's will. Okay, for me to wake you up. And if you don't want to be woken up by me, go live in the dark, but out of my face. Okay, don't don't be trying to live in the dark in my face, cause you gonna get corrected. You will be corrected. You will, man. You will be corrected. So let's pray, y'all. Dear Heavenly Father, I just want to say thank you. I pray you will help heal me as this nose running. Whatever sickness that's trying to enter into me, thank you for blocking it and healing me of it so that I can do the will you have me to do to sit down and read your good news to your people. One more time. One more time. <laughs> Woo, one more time. So that they can understand your love is pure toward them. And that they need to stop depending on other people to do with you are supposed to do with them. They keep giving other people your job in their life. Instead of surrendering to you, Lord, so they can witness who you are in their life. Mine is all the loud noise, confusion, distractions. Thank you for giving me the focus to continue pushing to read your good news. And I pray that you will have me to go around the world just reading out loud to your people and then dancing after that. So that the devil know he has no place, memorial, say, do, or touch near your creation ever again. Wherever you bless me to go, to reach your word to your people and dance for your kingdom. I pray it be so according to your riches and glory and not man perverting. And I pray that wherever you have me do it, either right here as well, sitting down reading. I pray it will heal them through the screen, Lord, according to their open heart towards you. And may they learn to stop idolizing family over you, Lord Jesus Christ, because they don't understand that they can't have family without you being the priority first. Because you told us if we pick our family over you, we are not ready to follow you. We are not worthy to do the will you bless us to work because we pick family over our Lord and Savior who created family for us. I pray that those who are listening and paying attention as we read out loud and through the prayer that they will be met in that dark place. That's hindering them, that's stopping them, that's oppressing them, that's depressing them from focusing on the light. Jesus Christ, our Lord and Savior. I pray some kind of way. Excuse me. I pray some kind of way, Lord, that you will uh, tap them to remind them there's a way of escape if they call on you, Lord, according to their faith in you. Nothing less.
And I pray according to their faith in you that they will be healed, fulfilled, satisfied to the mind, body, soul, and spirit in every breath, in every heartbeat, in every organ functioning of this body, and the connected bones aligning their will to your perfect will for their life so that you may get the glory out of our life. And those around them will be saved from going to hell because they believe in Jesus Christ, the righteous, the gift, the light of the world, and that's being obedient to the truth. Have your way in this, Lord, with your Holy Spirit, and thank you for the miracles that will happen, seen and unseen, known and unknown, heard and unheard. May you be glorified, uplifted, and exalted to our all your creation. Nothing less. In Jesus' name. Amen. Thank God. Amen again. Cut. Oh, here we go. So, all right, sir. So, 1,285. My aunt Anna's Holy Bible. Cookies. In the one, chapter 6, in the book of L-U-K-E, book of Luke. Titus say, Lord of the Sabbath. I noticed I'm taking my time because I wanted to see if they were going to clock me. Like I said, this phone been getting hot, real hot to the point I had to put it down and let it cool off. So, God is good. God is time. Good. All right. The devil is a liar. All right. You ready? He know he loves. He know he loves. Cookie. Chapter 6, verse verse 1. Ready? Give you a second. Amen to that. Verse 1. Cookie. And then that's one. And it came to pass on the second Sabbath, after the first comma, that he went through the cornfield. Let me come. And his disciples plucked the ears of corn, comma, and did eat, comma, wrapping them in their hand, period. Verse 2. And certain of the Pharisees said unto them, comma, Why do ye that which is not lawful to do on the Sabbath day? Question mark. Verse 3. And Jesus answering them said, Come, Have ye not read so much as this, Come, what David did, Come, when himself was in hungry, Come, and they which were with him? Semicolon. Verse 4. How he went into the house of God, Come, and did take and eat the shoe bread, Come, and gave also to them that were with him. Semicolon which it is not lawful to eat, but for the priest alone. Question mark. Verse 5. And he said unto them, comma, that the Son of Man is Lord also of the Sabbath. Period. Verse 6. And it came to pass also on another Sabbath, comma, that he entered into the synagogue and taught clearly. And there was a man whose right hand was withered. Period. Verse 7. And the scribes and Pharisees watched him. Comment. Whether he would heal on the Sabbath day. Semicolon. That they might find an accusation against him. Period. Verse 8. But he knew that thought. Comment. And said to the man which had the withered hand. Comma, rise up, comma, and stand forth in the midst, period. And he arose and stood forth, period. Verse 9, then Jesus, then said Jesus unto them, comma, I will ask you one thing, semicolon, is it lawful on the Sabbath day to do good, comma, or to do evil, question mark, to save life, comma, or to destroy it? Question mark. Verse 10. 
and looking round about upon them all, comrade, he said unto the man, comrade, thrust for thy hand, period. And he did so, cut. And his hand was restored whole at the other, period. Verse 11. And they were filled with madness. They wasn't happy. They was filled with madness. Semicolon. And commune one with another. What they might do to Jesus. Period. Verse 12. And it came to pass in those days, Colin, that he went out into a mountain to pray, Colin, and continued all night in prayer to God. Period. Verse 13. And when it was day, Colin, he called unto him his disciples, Colin, and of them he showed twelve, Colin, whom also he named apostles. Semicolon. Verse 14, Simon, comma, open parenthesis, whom he also named Peter, comma, close parenthesis, and Andrew, his brother, comma, James and John, comma, Philip and Bartholomew, comma, verse 15, Matthew and Thomas, comma, James, the son of Alphys, comma, and Simon, called Zelotes. I pray I said that right. Comma, verse 16. And Judas, the brother of John, comma, and Judas Iscariot, comma, which also was the traitor. Period. Verse 17. And he came down with them, comma, and stood in the plant, comma, and the company of his disciples. And the great multitude of people out of all Judea and Jerusalem, comma, and from the sea coast of Tyre and Sidon, comma, which came to hear him, comma, and to be healed of their diseases. Semicolon. Verse 18. And they that were vexed with unclean spirit, colon, and they were healed, period. Verse, ni- verse 19. And the whole multitude sought to touch him, clearly, for there went virtue out of him, comma, and healed them all, period. Verse 20. And he lifted up his eyes on his disciples, comma, and said, comma, Blessed be ye poor, comma, for yours is the kingdom of God. Period. Verse 21. Blessed are ye that hunger now, Colin, for ye shall be filled. Period. Blessed are ye that weep now, Colin, for ye shall laugh. Period. Verse 22. Blessed are ye, comma, when men shall hate you, comma, and when they shall separate you from their company, comma, and shall reproach you. Comma, and cast out your name as evil, comma, for the Son of Man's sake. Period. Verse 23. Rejoice ye in that day, comma, and leap for joy, calling for, comma, be heard, comma, your reward is great in heaven, calling for in the like manner did their fathers unto the prophet. Period. Verse 24, but woe unto you that are rich, exclamation point, for ye have received your consolation, period. Verse 25, woe unto you that are full, exclamation point, for ye shall hunger, period. Woe unto you that laugh now, exclamation point, for ye shall mourn and weep. Period. Verse 26. Woe unto you, comma, when all men shall speak well of you. Exclamation point. For so did their father to the false prophet. Period. Verse 27. But I say unto you which hear, comma, love your enemies, comma, do good to them which hate you. Comma. Verse 28. Bless them that curse you. 
common, and pray for them which despitefully use you. Period. Remember that. Period. Verse 29. And unto them that smited thee on the one cheek, offer also the other semicolon. And him that taketh away thy cloak, forbid not to take thy cloak, thy coat, also, period. Sorry about that. Verse 30. Give to every man that asketh of thee, semicolon. And of him that taketh away thy good, ask them not again. Period. Verse 31. And as ye would that men should do to you, comrade, do ye also to them likewise. Period. Verse 32. For if ye love them which love you, comrade, what thank have ye? Question mark. For sinners also love those that love them. Period. Verse 33. And if ye do no and if ye do good to them which do good to you, comma, what thank what thank have ye? Question mark. For sinners also do even the same. Period. Verse 34. And if ye lend to them of whom ye hope to receive, comma, what thank have ye? Question mark. For sinners also lend to sinners, comma, to receive as much again. Period. Verse 35. But love ye your enemy, comma, and do good, comma, and lend, comma, hoping for nothing again. Semicolon. And your reward shall be great, comma, and ye shall be the children of the height. Colon. For he is kind unto the unthankful and to the evil. Period. Verse 36. Be ye therefore merciful, comma, as your father also is merciful. Period. Verse 37. Judge not, comma, and ye shall not be judged. Curly. Condemn not, comma, and ye shall not be condemned. Curly. Forgive. And ye shall be forgiven. Colon. Verse 38. Give, comma, and it shall be given unto you. Semicolon. Good measure, comma, press down, comma, and shaken together, comma, and running over, comma, shall men give unto your bosom, comma, I mean, period. For with the same measure that ye met with all, it shall be measured to you again. Period. Verse 39. And he spake a parable unto them. Comma. Can the blind lead the blind? Question mark. Shall they not both fall into the dish? Question mark. Verse 40. The disciple is not above his master. Colon. But everyone that is perfect shall be as his master. Period. Verse 41. And why beholdest thou the moat that is in thy brother's eyes, comma, but perceivest not the beam that is in thy own eye? Question mark. Oh. Verse 42. Either how canst thou say to thy brother, comma, brother, comma, let me pull out the moat that is in thine eye, comma, when thou thyself beholdest not the beam that is in thine own eye. Question mark. Thou hypocrite, comma, cast out first the beam out of thine own eye, comma, and then, thou, and then shalt thou see clearly to pull out the moat that is in thy brother's eye. Period. Verse 43. For a good tree bringeth not forth corrupt fruit, semicolon, neither does the corrupt tree bring forth good fruit. Period. Verse 44. For every tree is known by his own fruit. Period. For a thorn men do not gather figs, comma, nor of a bramble bush gather thy grapes. Period. Sorry about that. Verse 45. 
A good man out of the good treasure of his heart bringeth forth that which is good. Okay. And an evil man out of the evil treasure of his heart bringeth forth that which is evil. Cause for as the abundance of the heart is the mouth. My bad. For as the abundance of the heart his mouth speaking. Period. Let me repeat that, verse 45. A good man out of the good treasure of his heart bringeth forth that which is good. Semicolon. And an evil man out of the evil treasure of his heart bringeth forth that which is evil. Colon. For of the abundance of the heart his mouth speaketh. Period. Verse 46. And why call ye me, comma, Lord, comma, Lord, comma, and do not the things which I say? Question one, verse 47. Whosoever cometh to me, comma, and heareth my saying, comma, and doeth them, comma, I will show you to whom he is like. Curly. Verse 48. He is like a man which built in house, comma, and dig deep, comma, and laid the foundation on a rock, curling. And when the flood arose, come, the stream beat vehemently upon that house, come, and could not shake it, curling, for it was founded upon the rock, period. Verse 49. But he that heareth, come, and doeth not, come, is like a man that without a foundation built a house upon the hurt, uh, upon the earth semicolon, against which the stream did beat vehemently comma, and immediately it fell semicolon. and the ruin of the house was great period chapter 7 man. besides my money nerd interfering I apologize to y'all but you already know what I'm about to say if you're not healed and fulfilled, go in your secret place on your knees and ask God for the Holy Spirit. Please, okay? Please, don't be trying to read God's word because all that was enough. That was a whole sermon right there, okay? And you're not going to understand that one word without the Holy Spirit. Man, what are they doing? All right, but anyway... <laughs> they trying to throw her out with ice so. um calling the Holy Spirit to guide you so you can understand what, what, what just happened what just happened yeah. now, not just what you read but what just happened while you was reading okay Oh, wow. See, I brag and boast in the Lord because he's worthy to brag and boast about. All the evil these people been putting me through and God lead me to get through Y'all cannot sit there and say through this screen while you watching me continue that God don't love you. You can't tell me God don't love you. You cannot tell me that. You can't. All the evil I done been through, yeah. And to still be able to have a calm, <laughs> a calm demeanor. Sit down with this Holy Bible open. It's not even my Holy Bible. It's a gift. Appreciate the gift to where I can turn this phone on, press record, and pray for those I don't see, don't know. You can't tell me a holy God don't love you, yeah. You can't, yeah. You can't, yeah. So if you end up in hell, I'm going to fuck you at. Yeah. 
Because I'm not doing all this for you to end up in hell. I'm not. I'm doing it for the opposite. So you can be in heaven with your Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. God the Father and the Holy Spirit. Okay? I ran y'all ear off long enough. And his phone getting hot. It keep it keeps sending me these little messages saying it's gonna cut off if I answered the phone while these people were calling me while we was reading. Wait, it's a whole lot going on. So I'm gonna keep it simple with you. I'm gonna tell you thank you for reading out loud with me. I pray you healed, fulfilled, satisfied to the mind, body, soul, and spirit. If not. Go in your secret place on your knees and ask for the Holy Spirit so he can give you that fulfillment because you only going to get it from God, Jesus Christ, and the Holy Spirit. The world don't care about your peace. It wants to kill you. It wants to destroy you. It wants to swallow you up like a plant. Okay? It, it don't care about you. God do. Jesus do. The Holy Spirit leads you to understand that God and Jesus love you. I pray you catch and learn here. Yeah. In Jesus' name. Uh, put the weapons down. Pick up the Holy Bible. Keep flapping your wings. Oh, and don't look down, okay? Don't look down, y'all. Yeah. Hell is not a place for you. It's not. And, and if you end up in there, Expect to see me. Expect to see me. Expect to see me, man. Cause I'm not playing with y'all, bro. God didn't leave lead you over here not to be fulfilled. He didn't. He didn't, man. You can't tell me God don't love you, man. You can't. And if you think you can, try me. I'll wait. Till then, peace. Love you. Salute to you and yours. Cookies. And then that's one. Right.